Ladies and gentlemen, it's a blessed morning. One more time, coming to you is a pleasure. I know that God is doing wonder, miracle, sign in your life. I believe that this morning I got a word um, from Romans chapter 1 and verse 16. I will be reading. Please listen to the word of God and I hope you are encouraged by the word of God. For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God unto salvation to everyone that believeth, to the Jew first and also to the Greek. I want to tell you that this morning you cannot be ashamed of the gospel. The gospel brings saving grace. The gospel redeems. The gospel set free. The gospel break the yoke of bandage. This gospel is sharper than any twedged sword. And because the gospel is so powerful, Paul said, I'm not ashamed of the gospel. Every nation must hear the gospel. Every town the gospel must preach to. This holy, righteous word of God. And I believe that this morning, that if you stand up for Jesus, Jesus will stand up for you. Are you shame of the gospel? Are you decreeing and declare the gospel to the folks in your workplace? You got to tell them about Jesus. Are you telling your family member about Jesus? Are you decreeing and declare the gospel to those that are unsaved? Because the gospel is power. The gospel of Jesus Christ. Let's pray. Heavenly God, we thank you this morning for your holy word. We thank you for your prophetical five minutes of utterance in the spirit realm. God, we thank you for this gospel that save and set free. And we pray, God, that all those that are bound by the spirit of darkness, I decree and declare that the power of this gospel shall set them free. I decree and declare they shall save by this gospel. And, O oh God, you shall redeem their soul by this gospel. You are the true and living God. I decree and declare that this gospel shall cut and break every plan of the adversary. Set the captain free. Loose those who are bound by the blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I pray God that your blood will uh, stimulate and sanctify. Break down the high tower, the high horizon fence, the fence of darkness, the fence of principalities. And I decree and declare by the power of Jesus Christ that every chain is broken in the name of Jesus by the power of the gospel. I believe that there is power in the word of God and to set you free and if you decree and declare it it shall be established over your life. Walk into the power of the gospel. Decree the word of God over your life. And you shall be blessed by this great gospel, the gospel of grace, the gospel of peace, the gospel of love, the gospel of joy, the gospel of happiness. This gospel shall keep you in perfect peace if you keep your mind and the word of God. Encourage yourself today in the Lord, tap your self and say, I am more than a conqueror by this gospel. I hope you are blessed. I hope God is keeping your soul and watching over you and protecting you in a time like this. Pray, pray.